Yeah. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. It is 6.38, I'm doing my hair, don't mind my wig. It's 6.38 and guess what today is? It's pop-up shop day for my business, my first one at the Charlotte Convention Center, period. Parents are here and they are still in the room sleep and they really need to get up. We have to um, start setting up at 8 a.m. And it's 6.39, I kind of want to leave the house at like 7.30, so literally in 30 minutes. And they're still asleep. I'm super excited. I don't think I understand how excited I am. See my little mannequin in the back? Yeah. So, I'm going to vlog today. So, I'm so excited to be able to do this. And I'm going to put like the information of the pop-up shop people page um in the bio but pretty much what it is is it's like a um, organization i want to say organization it's like a i say organization um or it's a company that puts on these pop-up shops around north carolina and you have to like apply to get in and the spots fill up so fast and I was like, it was one of my goals to, you know, do a pop-up shop. And I was just scrolling and scrolling and I found them like, oh, and they have a nice following. Like, yeah, they really, they really like that. So I was like, this is literally perfect for me. I applied and I got it. So that's exciting. And I think after the pop-up shop, um, we're like gonna go out to eat or something. The pop-up shop is literally a whole, a whole shift. It's 10 to 5, like, no joke. Now, we flat iron, so I'm probably just gonna break this up into pieces. I need to be done in like 10 minutes, because I wanna make me some breakfast. Yeah, I'm gonna make me some coffee at home. So I'm just gonna take piece by piece. I love this letter. Oh, so hot. Say hi to the camera. Oh, are you filming? Now, yeah. Good morning, camera. Daddy's <laughs> here helping daughter. <laughs> I am, I don't know what kind of beat I'm gonna do, but I think I'm gonna do under. Not under color. What is it called? Under underpainting. What's that? What about makeup? Um, it's cute. It's cute. It is doing a job. Okay. All done. Well, I have to go. I'm about to go make some breakfast real quick, and I'll probably talk to y'all when I get to the charlotte center because it's 7 20. everybody moving so slow um don't mind my house my apartment is a mess right now it's just it's, it's stuff everywhere um but i want to show y'all my outfit i think my outfit is so cute <laughs> logo on the back got these parachute pants on my yeah we're super cute period this lip color is hideous it looks like a unicorn threw up on my lips i don't know i think that made it worse wow it's that um my lips look like why do they look like that this lip color is not it. Um, it's giving pink throw up. And we're back. We're back in business.
pop-up shop has started and I'm so nervous. No sales yet, but I know it's coming. I know it's coming. Uh, we have the pop-up shop. It's popping. I got like 11 orders. It's so many people here, y'all. It's ridiculous. And my dad got me on most. Are you kidding me? Uh, but it's only 12.15 and we're done at 5, so, Woo. Hi, welcome! Oh, I hate the backdrop so much. It should be higher, but it's okay, you know better next time. If this doesn't look good in the pictures. It really don't look that bad. It's just you want it to be. You had a different vision. That's all. Ain't nobody else gonna know. That's your vision. People gonna see what it is. But definitely not this with her talking. Oh, well, y'all. That that's not the only one in there. It's actually a good picture, Jay. The one, because you got the whole thing. Yeah, that's why I sat back and took it. Yeah. This place is packed. So, team, you know the next thing to do now? You got to see what pop up shops they have in the surrounding cities. Yeah, I'm so tired. Um, it's my first time eating. It's 3 11. We've been here since 8. I'm tired, but we've been making money, So, yeah, we're gonna be here for a minute, then we're probably gonna get food or something. I don't know. I need to go to sleep. Everything is going so good. We have 30 minutes left. Um, I went shopping a little bit. Let me show y'all what I got. I bought this dress from this boutique, and it's so cute. Are you kidding me? Dress. big reflection once we get out of here because it's so loud but yeah uh, a little bit more of these left these I haven't even posted on the site yet and they're like almost sold out <laughs> these I only have like five left of these the sleep shirts these are almost sold out everything's kind of almost sold out this is my last bodysuit so yeah how do you feel about today Today was super exciting. I mean, we got here, it was kind of slow, and then all of a sudden, it was like boom, boom, boom. We boom, couldn't boom, sit boom, down. Boom, 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 <laughs> boom, 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 boom. I am so proud of my daughter. She really works hard every day. She's really consistent, and she just seeing now how hard work pays off. So keep doing what you do. You know, this is just the beginning. All small business start off slow. Just like the told your secrets. Guess what? We up next. How you feel? I feel great. Nice to see the place was a great turnout. Great uh, place for people to present the items that they offer in dedication and hard work leads to success, Jalen. Great job today, baby girl. Your papa's proud of you, boo. Keep up the good work. <laughs> I look super cute. Like, are you kidding me? I'm like, what? I want my sewing back. So cute. Swimwear on the way. Yeah. If you um, scan that on Instagram, that'll take you to my... Uh, I mean, scan the QR code, that'll take you to my Instagram. We are about to go inside of Mertz, Mertz, 
so hurt, hurt so if you're in charlotte you know what i'm talking about but they have like amazing like soul food and like fried chicken and yams and like macaroni and greens and like yeah it's top tier top notch food um so yeah that's where we're about to go eat after we eat y'all i'm probably gonna take a shower and knock out for the rest of the day i'm so tired i'm so tired last night we stayed up so so late tagging all my stuff and yeah but whew, I'm, tired, I'm, tired, I'm tired i'm tired i'm tired this is what a ceo does like this is just the life i'm just kidding but yeah, so I'm about to go in here with my family. It's like pouring down raining and it's cold as hell. Like, I hate it. But it is what it is. Um, yeah, so I will chat with you guys later. They got a lot of options. So, food. I think I'm going to get me the jumbo chicken wings and some veggies. Probably some macaroni and yams. So we got these soul rolls. They have black eyed peas, seasoned rice, collard greens, shredded chicken, like a mustard sauce on top. Putting tomatoes and onions in the greens. I thought it was in the cabbage. No. I don't. That's why I don't get greens. No way. I go. If it ain't Sandra event balance, I'm not. Oh, that's right. And that's on period. And that's on Patsy. And <laughs> salt and pepper over there. Yeah, you know, salt and pepper. So we gonna try the macaroni. I probably got asked for the macaroni. Not bad. That looks so right here. Now we're gonna try the yams. Mm. 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 That's the right type of soup. Try the chicken. I wish it was a little bit more crispy. That's it. Yep, I'm gonna shower and I'm going straight to sleep. So yeah, I'm finally back home. Um, the pop-up shop. So the pop-up shop that I did was called the um, Girl Tribe Pop-up Shop. And they're like, I'm gonna put all the information in the description box below. But they, um, the way that it works, you apply um for the pop-up shop and then they have to accept you once you get past that process you pay a fee and then um they give you all the information everything you need for the day of and then you set up and so each of their pop-up shops are at different locations i just so happened to be looking for a pop-up shop and it showed up and it happened to be at the charlotte convention center so i literally took advantage of it and I suggest any business owner to take advantage of a pop-up shop because I was able to expose my brand to people who probably would have never found it me. And um, I did a thing where like, if you follow me on Instagram, you get 50% off. And that's kind of a way to bring in more people into my business because now they're gonna see my posts, they're gonna see the new things that I post and kind of make them a reoccurring customer. So that was something that was so cool. I met so many people. I met other vendors and it was just a really good experience. Um, and I suggest anyone who, like I said, anyone who owns a business or a service to literally take advantage of pop-up shops. Um, this is my first one. I do plan on trying to do one like every other month. Um, I didn't want to necessarily disclose this information because I feel like maybe it's too much but i also feel like it'll give some truth to what i'm saying if that makes sense i made a good amount of, of money today i had 30 
30 customers and today and some of those customers bought more than one thing bought one to three items so i did pretty pretty well for my first one it was 10 a.m to 5 p.m so i was on my feet all day every day that's the only thing you'd be on your feet all day every day i had a chair but i literally couldn't sit down because i kept getting customers we kept walking up asking me questions so yeah it was an ongoing um like standing thing <laughs> like uh, oh yeah also if you're trying to get rid of old inventory like i had old inventory from when i first start first launched i got rid of it today it's no longer in my possession because i literally took all of my inventory with me and i literally came back with probably less than half so i even literally went with items that i didn't even drop yet and now when i do officially drop it i don't even think i don't have any smalls no i don't have any mediums i don't have any larges. <laughs> i only have like smalls and like 2x and 3x and 4x so yeah but i'm gonna order some more but anyways that's besides the point i just wanted to say like if you're looking to get rid of inventory pop-up shops is the way to go um yeah other than that i had a really really great day my parents were such a big help today i don't know what i would have done without them like being up there by myself like would have been nuts i literally needed the help but yeah and now i'm about to shower and clean my apartment up because it looks a hot mess um tomorrow's easter sunday so we're going to go to church in the morning and um yeah so Thank you guys for watching this vlog. This is the end of the vlog. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have any questions in regards to pop-up shops, business questions about my personal life, like ask away in the comment section below. I'm gonna put all the information to my business, my Instagram socials, the pop-up shop information. I'm gonna put all that in the description box below. My next video, I'm doing a um, Amazon business haul. So you guys will be able to see everything that I use to like set up my pop-up shop, everything that I use to ship orders, et cetera, et cetera. Um, because I know that's something that I Googled and YouTube uh, starting out, just kind of knowing where to start. So I got gotcha. you. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel, like, comment, subscribe, do all that. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Yeah.